Hello, 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 and welcome to my Minecraft video. We're going into the official Twitch Prime realm for my channel. And we're going to work in the end, and we're going to do something dangerous. We're going to start building a bridge from the main Ender Island to another island that has some good stuff in it. Like a city and a flying ship, so... That's what we're going to do. We're going to do it. Uh, it's going to be very dangerous. I might die. We'll see how this goes. And, uh, okay, we're just going to wait for the realm to boot up. Generating world done! Oh, I'm in! Okay. Okay, that was weird. I heard, I heard it sounded like an iron golem dying or something. Okay, that was weird. Okay, so here's the thing. Um, this is very dangerous work, so I kind of don't want to lose my good stuff. Let's go into here. Do I have iron armor somewhere? Okay, so I'm going to put, we're going to try something. I'm going to take off my good stuff because I don't want to lose it on accident. And, oh, here, give me this. Oh, actually, I can keep this in here. Okay, so what we're going to do is put you there. Ooh. And what sword is this, by the way? It's a smite and knockback. Oh, that's a decent sword. We'll keep the sword. I'll put the dragon egg away. We'll put you away. Uh, I guess we can put this away, too. Uh, I'm going to make some more iron armor. I could make more diamond armor, but I really don't want to use diamonds. And, uh, iron's so easy to get. Or I could make leather. <laughs> well, the goal will be, I mean, I'm going to be, the only enemy I'm going to be facing at this point is, uh, Enderman. So, I hopefully won't need to. Okay, I need a pickaxe. I got a couple of pickaxes in case I need them. Uh, we need to get some cobblestone. So that, I think, is what we're going to do next. Uh, so, here's a bone. I can keep a bone. I have a bed. I don't need the bed. I'm going to actually put this bed back right there. And we're going to make this my... Oh, you know what, though? Actually, I just realized something. No. We're going to keep that. I don't have any... I don't know if we have any more cobblestone, so I'm going to have to go make some. Um, I do have, oh, I have end stone. Well, I have a lot of end stone. There's a little bit of cobble there. So basically all I'm going to need to do is get a couple of buckets because I'm going to need, oh, that's right. I'm going to make, oh, what am I going to make the machine out of? What materials do I want to make? So we're going to make a cobblestone generator and we're going to build a bridge. Andestite is tempting because I have a good amount of andestite. Okay, let's just make it out of andestite because it's going to be a temporary building. We're going to build a temporary machine. It's going to be a beautiful machine. The most beautiful machine you've ever seen. It's going to be wonderful. Okay, so let's go ahead and make my armor. So we need some boots. Some pants. A chest. And a helmet. Wow, I really kind of feel bad for using all that iron, but it's okay. Uh, and then I don't know if I want to enchant. Let's go see if there's anything that we're going to want to enchant this stuff with. Enchanting is good. Okay, so do we still have, we still have some lapis. Okay, there's a block there, I guess. So let's see. 
All right, so let's see what we got. I can put a helmet in here. I can get unbreaking, projectile protection. Uh, 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 okay, protection one. Why maybe? Uh, because you need to. So I have fifty six experience. So it's gonna cost six levels. Uh, what about the armor? Last protection. What about legs? Why? Feet? I really don't need any of these things. I feel like this is just a waste of time. If I die, uh, I am so totally going to be... Oh, maybe I should just break down and get like really good stuff. Okay. Oh, this gave me thorns. Okay, how much? Wow, I didn't... I still have 54? Okay, let me see what I can get with this. Blast protection. Okay. Oh, now it says 51. Okay, that's weird. Projectile protection, thorns, one feather falling. Okay, we'll go do that. So there, now I have some armor. I I think what we'll do is we'll, we're going to save and quit. And, uh, oh, I still have some iron legs. Okay. I'm just going to take off. I don't know why someone put that in a block. I'm just going to take that off. Oh, okay. So, okay, armor. What about a, a, this? Fortune 3. Unbreaking 2. Ah, on Fortune 3. I don't really think I need a Fortune 3. I don't want to die. I have a high level of, of uh, XP. So we did enchant some armor. Okay, we got, what? Protection 3 and thorns for my helmet. Pr blast protection. Uh, which is, if I get blown up by a creeper. Uh, no creepers in the end. Uh, protection 4 with Unbreaking 3 and Feather Falling and Projectile Protection. So, I mean, this is not bad. It's not great, but it's not bad. I should be theoretically okay. We're going to... Oh, should I bring the End Stone? We're going to make a chest. We're going to make a chest. Oh, pistons. I will need the pistons. Perfect. Mm. Also, I should take the crafting table. Uh, I don't think I need a furnace for any reason. No. Yeah. Oh, here's some regular stone, which I don't think I need. Birch trap door, I don't need. Okay, so... I'm, going, I'm not going to worry about what I'm bringing with me because I don't really have anything that important. So if I die and lose everything, it doesn't really matter. We need to get some... What, do I need even need the cobblestone? No, I don't need the cobblestone, do I? Uh-uh. Because we're going to use andestite to build my building. Oh, I could make polished andestite. Okay, why don't we why don't we make polished in death tight? It's I mean this is a temporary building that I'm gonna be building, so I guess it doesn't really matter, but Yeah Polished and Death Tight Oh 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 Okay, well, if anyone needs a polished and death start, I have made some on accident. Oh, a dropper. Excuse me. I just don't know if I need anything in here. Stone, stone, stone. Here's some more polished and death That should be plenty. Oh, we have some phantom membrane. Okay. 
So um, now all I need is a couple of buckets. Um, and I want to make a chest. I'm going to have some lumber somewhere. Okay, tools. There should be. There's only one bucket. Oh, there's a chest. I'll take a bucket, and I will see if I can find another bucket. Can I come out? I see no buckets. Oh, someone made an observer. I see no bucket in there. Let's go into the. Another world and see if I have a bucket. I have a feeling I have a bucket in another world. I do! I have two buckets. Perfect. Alright, well then let's leave one bucket here. Um, so, yeah, I think I got everything I need. I can always come back if I remember. Oh, I need something else, but I think I'll be okay. Um, I might need the ender pearls. I really hope I don't have to kill any endermen. I might end up... Oh, there's some more lapis. Okay. So what we're going to do is get a bucket of lava. And we need a bucket of water. Is there water near the stronghold? Is there water? I think there is. There actually might even be lava near the stronghold too. But I can get a bucket of lava. Now the question is where do I want to get the bucket of lava because if I take it from the nether, I don't really want to take it from the nether. It's going to detract from how cool this area looks. I mean I could always get another, see like if I take it out of here it's going to be kind of weird. Alright let's go back, yeah let's just go in the hole. in the stronghold. Uh, let me see if I can figure out how to get the fudge out of here because I tore this place apart about a lot. Okay. I see water, so I can get water in here. And I do need a bucket of water. Mm, okay, let me see. I can drop down here. Oh, there's some lava. Perfect. Okay. <gasps> Wait. Where's that coming from? Okay, well we got, we have uh, some cobble. Let's build a little. Yeah, now I'm using my cobble here. I probably should save it, but I won't really need it. And we're gonna make a cobble machine. Oh, okay. I just want this lava block. I just need to find the source of the lava block. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. You have to be kidding me. Okay, uh, give me... Okay, here's some stone. So we're gonna just keep destroying more. <laughs> this thing. Oh wait, look at this. Oh, it goes way up here. Oh, okay, cool. So it's not too far. Okay, let me dig. See, I'm gonna get some stone back. Okay, we have to be super careful right here because I do not have my fire protection armor because. I do not want to risk losing it. I think I can dig up here. Okay, now let's see if we can grab the lava. <laughs> when I jump, let me jump up here. No, it will not let me. Will not let me take it yet. So the. 
Oh, okay. I see where it is. There we go. Wait. Hold the phone. Uh, okay. Let's dig up this way. We're trying to do this very careful here. It should just be one source block. Yeah, that should be it. Okay. That was kind of strange, but I did get the lava block. This is good. Now we can watch the lava descend here. Dis disappear as it falls down. And I don't want to drop down there. Oh, I guess technically I do want to get the water down there. I need a water source block. So we'll... Give me... I'll just dig this out here. I really didn't know where to pull down. Wait, where does... Okay, or I could just go back up, I guess. Alright, never mind. That was... Here, let me just put you guys back there. I can just drop down. Oh, and there's a... There's, I forgot there's a whole mi ancient mining area thing over here, too. Okay, I can drop down here. Okay, so now we need to find a water source block. Looks like there's one some right here. Excellent. So now I think we have everything we need. Now I just have to get the fudge back up to the stronghold. <laughs> so I had been I had gone down here with my wife and we explored around here. I do not remember how we got back up. I think we just built back up. So I don't think there's an easy path up there. So I guess I will have to dig one. Or I could... Let's see. Oh, here's a block here. I could just do this here. Uh-oh. I mean, I should have enough cobblestone that I can dig back up. So now we're gonna go like this. Look at that. <laughs> this stronghold did not spawn in correctly. And it, at first I thought, oh, there's no end portal. It didn't spawn it in because it didn't spawn correctly. But then I was able to find it through some cheating. completely remove all this cobble and then I can build work myself back up here. Oh, the door still wants to open. Where's the wind coming from now? Okay, we'll leave it. Okay, so now I have to see look there's a figure out where I am in the stronghold. I kind of ruined a lot of the stronghold I dug out. I was looking, we were looking so hard for the stupid portal and then finally found it. And it was like right next to, oh, it was so stupid. Like, oh, it was, right, it was down here. This is where the portal was. Okay, so we got it. We have a chest. Oh, that's right, there's dragon's breath in here. Okay, well, I'm gonna put my bed right there and create a spawn point. Okay. So this way, if I die, it's okay. I mean, it's not okay, but it's, you know, like, I don't want to die. I'm, I'm level 47 here. I've got lots of... Okay, that covers that up. I just want to get rid of those blocks.
Okay, so, yeah, I think we're good. I don't really think there's anything else I need. I don't need sticky pistons. I don't have redstone. Fudge. I know there's redstone, but let's just go back in the portal. And get some redstone. <laughs> I don't want to jump back down. And... Okay. Some redstone. I should really just, like, pause the video here. Green screen's working very nice. Hmm. So, it might just be... Night streaming. I can't do night streaming. Okay. So I doubt I have any redstone in here. No. Seriously. That's all we need. Hopefully I'm not forgetting anything, but... Now we're ready to go into the end. Ooh, okay. Uh, I need to. Uh, I need to have the redstone here. Let's put the redstone there. Let's do it. Oh! Okay. So I'm a little nervous about going in the end without all my good armor and stuff, but. As long as I don't look at the Enderman, I should be okay. I don't want to die. If I die, I'll be super mad. And I will totally <laughs> dump the realm and reload and reinstall the realm just so I can... Mainly, I don't want to lose the XP. Because look at all this XP I have. So much. I should be fine as long as I don't look at the Enderman. Okay, so we're gonna go up here. I shouldn't have to fight them. I got. I only, I'm only gonna need like maybe two Ender Pearls at most. So. So this is a little. I'm a little nervous, I will, I'll admit, um, mainly because there's a lot of Endermen around here. Let's just run through here. 
Now, I probably can kill at least a couple of Endermen, but if I get swarmed, I'm in deep crap. I'm probably in deep crap, because I don't have my best gear and stuff. And that's all because I don't want to, like, die and lose everything. Okay, so, we know that the bridge has to be over here. It's got to connect from where I'm standing here over to that area. And we're gonna, so I think if we put the bridge right here, this is where we want to do it. Okay, so let's see. Let's go ahead and put a crafting table down and a chest. Okay, all right, now we can put, oh, craft brickstone. I want to put some of my, some of this stuff in here. Just in case. I mean, I'm not looking at you, I'm not looking at you, I'm not looking at you. Okay. Okay. So. And I've hooked up because I want the polished stone. I don't know if I get the ender pearls anymore. Okay. So. Oh my god. <laughs> Okay, so to do this, we're making, gonna make a simple, um, a um, simple <laughs> cobblestone generator. So the way we're gonna do it is we want to put have cobblestone being generated and being pushed along. Okay, so if we're gonna make, hmm. Um, Okay, let's make this right here where the cobblestone will come out. I don't think that's too bad. I think that'll be fine. Okay, so then what we need to do is this block is where the cobblestone will be generated. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, so right here is where the water, lava and water source blocks will be. These little spots right there. Okay, which means we need to build a little thing Okay. And then, you know, technically we need to put a block right above this one. Uh, the piston will be right there. So we, I do need the pistons. And we're using regular pistons. Now I can put a stone there. And then we're gonna go ahead and do like this. Just to kind of build a little. Okay, so we I guess it's probably a good idea to oh, okay, put that there. Alright, so um, let's go ahead and put a cobblestone block there. And now we're going to put in buckets of stuff okay so excuse me person so we're gonna put the lava right here and let that flow and then we'll put the water in there and let that flow okay so that's good okay Um, this is the back of the machine. Let's put a block in there. Okay, so the generator is built. Oh, I didn't bring... I didn't bring obsidian. Fudge. I forgot I was going to bring obsidian. Okay, so what we'll do is... Screw the obsidian. We're not going to... But I have an obsidian block so that I can stop the cobblestone generator from being able to produce more stone but because I did not bring any we're not gonna have that I guess it's not a big deal okay so now we need the redstone and we need to make did I not bring oh the stones in there. I put the stone away didn't I okay now we need to make some redstone devices and I might miss I'm missing Oh, I need to make... Okay, so we need to make 
some of these. I need two, four, six, I need eight. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And now I can make the repeaters. I need four repeaters. I need any more of the polished and dust type. Unless I want to cover it up. Maybe just for fun, let's cover it up. Right? Okay, so we're going to make a little stone pathway. Okay, uh, let's make one more. I guess this is good so that way I don't, like, accidentally get in the lava. Okay, and I can get on top of here if I need to get on top of there. Oh. Don't I want that in there? I think I want that in there, too. Okay. Okay, so. Now we got to make a little bit of a redstone path. So we're going to go like this. Um, and now we need to make... Now we need to make the redstone clock. So we're gonna make run the wire going out here a little bit, and then we're gonna put a repeater here, and we're gonna turn it up. We're gonna make it go move as slow as possible, and then we need a repeater here, and then a repeater right here. And let's see if I did this right. And then we put redstone to connect the circuit. Uh, okay, let's change this and have it go to there. Okay, and then uh, I need to make a button. I need two buttons. Okay, so you know what? I really probably should put one of these in here, and I can do the shield. Okay, so we put a button right here that will activate the machine, and let's do it. go so now the machine is working and as you can see it's pushing the cobblestone and it's gonna keep doing that until it gets to 11 blocks I believe 11 blocks okay so see now it's stopped so normally what I'd like what do I well what I was planning to do is for this block right here I'd have an obsidian block so it would stop there uh, but okay no big deal so now that we have the machine set up, it produces the cobblestone, which is great, but we need to go over the... Oh shoot, okay. I just, I think I got, I looked at someone wrong. Okay, um, I'm okay. Where's my food? I need to put my food in here. Okay. So obviously this is not going to create a bridge over there, but that's not why we have this set up here. So now uh, what we're going to do is we're going to push these cobblestones forward in the direction of that landmass. And in order to do that, we need to create a piston system. So we're going to get pistons. Oh, you know what? I should probably turn off the machine. That's not how you turn off the machine. I'm sorry. There you go. Okay, so that's how you turn off the machine. Ah! Okay, because the reason I did that is because I have to destroy um, some of these blocks. And we're going to make it a three block wide walkway. But we're going to have railings, so that way you can't fall off the bridge. So, one, two, three. 
Uh, four. This will be a side. So one, two, three. Wait. One, two, three. So this will be... So we're not going to have a piston here. Okay. So now we need to break these cobblestones. Um, I did, um, because I'm on bedrock, I went through a lot of, a few different designs trying to see how I could, the best way to make a bridge. And because I'm on bedrock, I think this is the, the most efficient, uh, safest way. It's not, it's going to take longer to do it this way than have some kind of like automated thing, but I couldn't get any of the automated designs to work. Okay. So we got. The pistons here. Now that we have the pistons here, we can activate the machine again. To replenish the cobblestone. Okay. Oh, shoes monkeys. I need to put another I missed it. I missed one. Let me see for a while. Oh shoot. So, one, two, three, four, five. So we have five pistons total. Three for the actual pathway, two uh, for the railings, for the walls. That will be on the side. Oh my god, where do I look when I don't get to aggro these guys? Okay. So that's perfect. And now we're going to put redstone wire here. And I'm going to go like this. And I'm going to get the polished stone back. Okay, now I'm going to put... Wait. Oh, I guess that'll work. It looks a little bit weird. Let's not put it right there. We're going to put it right here. And then we put a button right there. Okay, so. The way this should work is when I push the button, it's going to activate the pistons, push the pit block, and then the pistons will push the um, cobblestone blocks forward one, and then it'll turn off, and then the machine will make another line of cobblestone. And then you push the button again, that'll get pushed again, and we'll keep doing that until the pistons can no longer push uh, cobblestone over. So let's test it. Perfect. So now as you can see, we pushed one section over and we've replenished the cobblestone. Uh, I think this is fairly efficient, but it does mean that someone has to stand here and put this button. And oh, let's, do it like, let's do it like this. <laughs> so, um, oh, I did have an axe with me. <laughs> uh, so the benefit to this is it's not too, it's not going to take too much time. It's not too bad, right? You're just, it's not as nice as like an automated system would be where you would, it would be much faster to build a bridge. But this gives me a five block wide bridge and it doesn't take too long. Uh oh. Okay, it, it did break. Okay, let's try it. Uh, that is the downside to this type of uh, cobble generation system on bedrock. Uh, it does break down sometimes, so every time it breaks down. really breaking down a lot. I guess I could have done this differently. It 
It's because the lava and the water, uh, they don't flow at the same speed. So sometimes it breaks down. Okay, so see, here we go. So most of the time it's, it'll work fine. So this will keep going and eventually it'll stop. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, this should be the last time it works. Calculated. Oh, it's still working. Okay, now it's not going to work. So, no matter how hard I push it now, the pistons cannot move the blocks over anymore. This is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13 blocks. Okay, so that's the limit. 13 blocks is the limit. So as you can see, not too much trouble. Uh, it doesn't take too long to actually push the 13 blocks. But now that we can't push it over anymore, uh, there's a couple of things you can do. Uh, now, when I first had a design like this, hold on. The first time I made a, uh, a system like this, I would go the 13 blocks and then I would tear down the um, the um, cobblestone generator and then rebuild it at the 13th block point and the pistons and then I would create cobblestone uh, and then I would push the blocks um, 13 thing times over and I think that's what I have to do but I had another idea so this is going to create the 13 blocks. I, so that's basically what I have to do, I think. Is I have to recreate this machine right here and then push another 13 blocks over. If I... Yeah, that, well, I thought I had... I was thinking of it. What if I could just move the pistons? Okay, so if I move the pistons, I have to move the pistons basically to this block right here. And um, I can't leave the yeah I can't leave the machine here unless I push. all of these blocks oh I could keep well okay so what I could do is I could remove the pistons remove this block of cobblestone put the pistons here and then push these blocks over a little bit more and just keep doing that until I get to a dangerous point and then I could create more blocks here but I don't think that really makes sense. So I think the most efficient thing to do is to deconstruct all of this bridge building equipment and then rebuild it over here. So that is gonna be dangerous because I won't have all this land, but on the flip side, I may not have to worry about all of these uh, endermen. So now we have to... And of course, another downside to this method is as I get over the gap, uh, there's a chance that I will lose my equipment because it'll drop down to the abyss so I have to be careful okay now before I do that I'm gonna start I'm gonna mine some of this stuff There's, I already have some cobblestone from good. 
Okay, so we're gonna make some stairs. Uh, I only need one stack, I believe, right? Because we're only gonna have one, two, three. So this is gonna be the front part of the bridge, the entrance to get on here. Hey, you know, another good, yeah, on here. And then, uh, of course, on the sides again, it's going to be uh, stone walls so that you can't get off. So that's good. Okay, so uh, we are now <laughs> we are now ready to uh, prepare the bridge. I, you know, I could do is I can leave this clock here, so I don't have to deconstruct the clock yet. So we will leave that there, but I will have to deconstruct this whole thing. Okay, so now to do this, we need to start building a, a platform to where we can put the next um, cobblestone generator. So I do want to come, come, come down here. Okay, I need to see if I can make a... Okay. So right here, this is going to be... A little platform to where I can start. I really wish I could leave that. I mean, I could leave this one here and go get another bucket of lava and water, and I kind of want to do that. Okay, so we want the cobblestone. to come through this way. Okay. If I break this, okay. That's okay, we can lose a block. Okay. So that means that where do we put the pistons? We need to put the, we need to put the pistons here uh, and that means that <laughs> we need to create I think we need to create a line of cobblestone underneath this block here okay so what we need is uh, okay so let me go back there let me see if I can make another I mean, I'm holding the button down to crouch, so it's, I'm okay, I'm okay. <laughs> okay, so, I'm just gonna hold the button down. Okay, so, uh, I need to take out, I could have probably saved that cobblestone, but I guess I don't really care. I only lost a couple of them. Okay. And then... Okay, what makes me nervous is I have to come back a little bit. There we go. So now we've got the cobblestone. Okay. I don't want to look at you. Why are you guys coming out over here? Okay. So, uh, we need some here. And then this is where the button is going to be for. This is how we'll push the next set. And so what that, well, what this is going to do too is once I get another 13 blocks across, then I have to tear out these pistons here and replace them with cobblestone. Um, but that's okay. So now we've got that in. Uh, now we have to start building uh, 
the um, generator. So um, this is where the cobblestone is going to be created. This right here is where the piston is going to be. You know what? I just realized something I should... Uh, I should I should place the let me go get another piston. I should put the piston down. There is a part of me that's like go I should go back and get another water and I could I guess I well it's kind of a pain in the butt though to get another water source and blah blah blah. Okay, so that's the piston that will be pushing the blocks and I will place a block there. Um I am going to, you know, I think I am going to go get another water source, another lava source. That way I have a dedicated uh, machine. And uh, this time we're not going to make, I don't want to tear down the whole thing. Okay, so we will be right back. But so far, it's looking good. I'm, I'm liking it. Oh, you know, it's, we'll just have to see what, oh, I didn't bring the buckets with me, did I? So far away from the spawn point. I'm gonna have to make up now. Okay, so I could get another water and another lava source from here. Oh, that's right, there's lava right here, too. I didn't keep the... No, I did not.
almost one block out of that. Okay, I'll take it. Okay. Okay, so we are back, and now we have another bucket of lava and water, and we're gonna put them in the chest for now. Okay, so I left all the cobblestone here. If I need more, I can generate more. I have another Okay. So, um, now I want to build... Okay. So... Oh my god. Okay, so right there is where the lot water is going to be. thinking of how I'm going to make this. Okay, so right here's where the water is going to be, right? So we need shouldn't have that there that's kind of <laughs> okay so the water flows down here so I need to create a block here and a block there okay ah. yeah so I'm gonna what I'm gonna need to do is generate some more cobblestone um, As you can see, we're gonna leave it open too. Uh, wait, I need to, I need to go like this. Okay. Oh wait. Okay, that's. <laughs> okay, it's gonna work. Okay. Uh, I just realized I probably should have moved this whole thing black back a block, but. I think it's still gonna work out okay. So, basically, oh my god. The lava block is gonna come down into here. It shouldn't hurt, hurt this guy. And the water's gonna go in there. Okay, and it should push it. So it's gonna be exposed, but I'm okay with that. 
we are going to have this long line of block here that will be sticking out on the side. But I mean, I'm not really, that's not really gonna matter too much. Okay, so what I need to do now is I need to, I need to start cobblestone here a little bit. I need some more. Uh oh. The machine broke again. This does happen. With the design. It's a fallible design. Okay, I need these guys. I don't need that much cobblestone. I just need a... Because, really, for this machine to work perfectly, it needs to always be... The piston needs to be always working. And so when the piston sits like this for a while, sometimes the flow of the lava and the water, it doesn't work correctly and, you know, it messes up, so. Okay, so because what I need to do is I need to build, oh, you know what, I can go right here. Okay, and build like a, this is, wait, wait, did I miss something up here? Because the piston, where the piston is, it, I think it's blocked. Isn't it? Oh, let me tear this one out. Yeah, so see, we can't have this one right there. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, uh, I need to make... I'm gonna go a little bit over. Ah, uh, I cannot quite. Okay, it won't let me, so. Let's do it this way. And then I can come in here and put that. Okay, so now I need to go get some redstone. So, I can now run a redstone line from here, and it should, I don't think it's too far. Oh yeah, it is. It's a little too far. I need another repeater. I think. I think I need two of these. Yeah. Okay, well look, we have enough. So, uh... This... So this cobblestone generator will always be here. But the second one that I've built, that's the one that I'm going to dismantle and rebuild. Okay, so uh, what I need to do then is I need to put, oh wow, okay, I need to put the repeater right here. Take that off. Okay. All right, so now everything should be set up. I broke the circuit so that way I can give me a chance here to add. Oh, we do need to have a block there. Oops, I didn't, I don't want the buckets with me. Oh 
pushes. This is potentially bad. Okay, I'll let no. I think it's okay, I did not damage you. <laughs> Okay, well, let me see what happened here. Okay, I see what happened. The lava, the water flows too fast. So I need to block that, and then we need to break that, and then I need to put that down, and then I can break this, and then I can break that, and that. Okay, so now, I don't know where those are going from. <laughs> okay, so now we can try this. Now we can put the circuit in. There we go. So a less fancy version of my generator. And we're gonna let it keep going till it can't make any more. So, um, at some point, we will have this floating part of the bridge there, but that's okay. Okay, so... This should still work. Perfect. Okay, when I do make the... When I tear down this generator, and I make the next part, I'm going to do it a little bit better. Uh-oh. So, I don't really care that this is a flawed design because, see what's happening is the water is getting in there too soon. There's no, and the piston is pushing the water away. So the uh, lava doesn't get a chance to get in there. What the heck, I thought I, I, thought I just made a... It's not a great design. There we go. You have to really keep up with it. Like, see, like if you keep up with it, it'll won't break. This is not too bad. This is gonna work. Now you can see that part of the, one of the pistons has already fulfilled its, it's, it's pushing more stone. So it's gonna get done faster than the other pistons because I didn't uh, build the generator correctly. Well, this is not too bad. It seems fairly safe to do it this way. So we've reached the end. So, yeah, it's quite a bit of ways to go, but <laughs> this will this will work. Okay. So for safety purposes, let's put the lava in the water. some more cobblestone. I could probably go... Okay. okay, so... Oh, I thought I lost that block, which is actually okay if I do lose it, but... Okay, so now I can break off this part. 
Uh, I will not tear this whole thing down right now, but we will eventually do that. Oh shoot, do not. Okay, and then we have to manually put these blocks in. Okay. So now we have to come all the way over here and we have to build another part. Now to do this part, uh, it's a little trickier because I don't have the ground, right? So I have to kind of build off of this platform. So yeah, I need to go get more cobblestone. I can get some from here. I don't need this. Uh oh. I need to break this. So. Okay, so I am going to kind of try to keep the repeater going, I think. Because I'd rather not. I found a flaw in the design here because that piston <laughs> I could lose the piston if I'm not careful okay let me see okay good so this platform we're going to be building god that scares me we're going to extend the platform so I might uh, go ahead and leave that machine there and just keep extending the power line all the way to the edge instead of having so that way I don't have to tear down this whole thing I think that's a good idea but it does mean I need more cobblestone and I do thankfully have that generator here right but once my uh Once my uh, pickaxe breaks, I'm gonna have to go back. There's a mark made a better a, a better machine. You know what? Let's see. Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Oh shoot! I did not look at you. Yeah, I think I might decide to actually use my better gear next time. I think I'm. I think it's okay. I just didn't want to risk it. What if I fall down, right? But I'm doing okay. I just should not have been. Um... Dude, you are seriously right where I need to be. Okay, let me try. Probably would be better to use a stone pickaxe. Oh, see, the machine's still working. Okay. 
Okay. So, hold down the shift. I need to make two, three. Okay, so this is where. Okay, that's. Okay, the piston's gonna be right here. So as you can see, yeah, we're gonna make this a little different. I just put that block there so I could mark where the piston's gonna go. Okay. So this is where the lava block goes. So you can see that I need to There's a piston. So this is what we're gonna do. So we are adjusting this a little bit. All the all these blocks right here are probably just gonna stay. Oh, they will probably have to stay. I could remove them. I might remove them later, but uh, it's all gonna be lost. It's gonna be really hard to to sac to save. Okay, so, and then of course, ooh, this line is gone because I have to make a, oh my god. Okay, so let me go get, So close. It almost powers it. Okay. Uh, I need more. I need more cobblestone. And this is pretty safe to do mine like this because I'm looking at the ground, so I'm not going to aggro the Enderman. I really like I really like this this plan. I think this is the safest, easiest way, most efficient way to do this. Uh, and I can, if I have to get more cobblestone, I can get it here. Uh, and then I'm, I, and then uh, I'm only re removing the secondary machine. See now the machine is running pretty well. I don't know. There's always going to be a chance it breaks down again, but it's an easy fix to, to fix it. Okay, let's see. Okay, so now I have to destroy this line. And uh, for this bridge, it's really only to get to the other side so that we can start getting some good stuff like the flying cape thing, I, I, Electra, or a little, I don't know what they call it. And then of course to get the skulker, skulker boxes and stuff. So I don't really care about the aesthetics of this bridge at all. Uh, at some point I, I may try to make it look cooler it's just super dangerous to do, to mess with it. So I'm just gonna, it's gonna be utility. That's basically what it's gonna be for. Okay, so now we have the button. Yeah. So that's working. Okay, so then now this next part's a little iffy, but put you 
there. Let's put another block there. That'll make me feel better. <laughs> okay. And then we just block there. So that should block, that should do it. Yeah, okay, I think next time I will bring my better stuff. Just because I'm, this is working out okay. I'm not falling off the, the thing, so. Oh, I do need this. I'm gonna need to make another computer. more supplies. We're not finishing the bridge uh, today. This will be a part one. Uh, but, uh, it's okay. Boom. So I really only need the one st stone. So let's go ahead and place the water in the lava. Okay. So now we just need to put the repeater in. Let's put it right here. There we go. It really does give you an idea how far we are still pretty far away as I build this bridge. Uh, but yeah, and then of course, yeah, so I do think I will, I'm, I will probably at some point come back here and remove all of the side, I guess to clean it up um, but it's gonna be really dangerous like obviously when I build bridges I like to have pedestals and stuff underneath to make it look like it's being supported uh oh but in this case that's not really gonna happen <laughs> there's nothing on the bot oh my gosh see this breaks down a lot but for this kind of job, it's okay because you're gonna just tear this whole thing down anyway. It's not a permanent. It's not a permanent fixture. Yeah, the button, I don't know why I didn't think about using the buttons in my earlier designs. I use switches and this is a much better idea using the button. I don't have to keep switching it and off, the button will do it for me. Well, at least the button will turn off the pistons for me. So, most of the time is the prep work. Once you get everything set up and you start building the bridge, that part's quick. It looks, f it looks closer than it really is the other side. Okay. Okay, so we've reached the end that we can do for here. So like look at this. So I'm here kinda at the edge. We are closer. 
than we were before. Oh my god, they're coming on my bridge. Uh, but there's still a lot of uh, distance to cover here, and we still haven't, we still can't see the city in the distance. So I think the uh, let me see. Go in the settings and we look at video. We have a 72 chunk distance. And if I am correct, that means each one block is a chunk, I believe. So we are still not 72 blocks close to the other side because I cannot see. Like, I can see 72 chunks is like probably right there. But we're not close enough to see the uh, city yet. So we're still pretty far. Okay, so now I can kind of break some of this down and I can get some of my stone back. I'm trying to stay kind of close so I can catch these blocks, but. Oh, shoes. I gotta be careful. I do not want to lose a piston. Although the piston is not a horribly difficult thing to replace. It's just... I don't want to lose it. I don't have to lose it. Okay. Damn it. I hate it when I do that. Okay, so now we can recover these pistons. And now we put... Line in there. Excellent. Okay. Um. So as you can see, I think I can keep going. I kind of don't want to have the water or lava block in my inventory. <laughs> So, this line is where the pistons are going to be, so I can go ahead and build this part. So I have, I need a lot of blocks because I have to come back over here and build. Now I guess I don't need to build it all the way to the side, but you know what, it's a bit safer to do that. So yeah, I'm going to use more cobblestone this way, but safety first. here for a couple hours. You can see that the Endermen are starting to use the bridge. Because they think they can... Oh my god. Because they think they can use it. Okay. You son of a bitch. I'm going to ruin that. Lose that block. Because I placed it wrong. Okay, 
so... Let me turn off this part. Oh no! The blocks are gone! I really don't like the Enderman on the bridge. Fall down. I cannot fall down. Oh shit. <laughs> okay, I forgot. I didn't build this part here. Okay, so. First piston goes right there. Oh my god. Uh, see, I'm gonna run out of. I guess I could keep working until this thing breaks. I don't think I have read enough redstone to make it over. I don't like you guys being so close. Don't stand so close to me. Okay. Okay, I don't need... out of here. died. Ah, oh, okay. Now the question is, can I, I don't have, I don't think I have enough redstone. I only have four redstone. So I can 
not, I definitely am not gonna be able to keep the signal. Okay, let's go get some more stone. We're gonna just do a, one more section of the bridge. I know, I could go mine some, but eh. I'm just gonna check to see if I always see that any redstone. Lapis Luzi. But no, it looks like we don't have any redstone down here.
And of course, where fuck this went up. Although you could put stairs. Okay, so we're back at the bridge, and we have plenty of redstone. I brought an extra stack for me for later. Um, and we're just going to do one more stretch. Let me make sure I don't look at the enemy. And I just realized I need a repeater. Let's see. I forgot. Oh, we need to go back now. So, let's put the repeater right here. Okay. We've got stone still. I have some sticks. of this redstone. I don't know if I'll need any more redstone than that. kind of just want to keep extending the line here. Why don't we go like this? Give me that. Can go like this? No. Happening here is the signal. Okay, there we go. I could shut off the sig the cl the redstone clock and then reactivate it. If I have to do that, I will. Okay, so now we got that. That's working. Let me, let me do that, because the timings, it looks like the timings are getting off. Okay, well, let's try it. I mean, it's so far away, so. Okay, yeah, that's what I thought. That's, the timing is, but now it should be. so cool it's so much fun to <laughs> push the pistons now of course another way you could do this is if you had a ton of pistons you could just instead of tear out these pistons and this whole machine work you could just build another one at the 13th block range and just keep doing that but this is much more 
efficient use of resources to tear down the to tear down everything. But again, if you had plenty of resources, you could leave all of the redstone generators intact and the piston mechanisms and then just replace the pistons with cobblestone later and then tear everything down, but I think this is definitely a better way to go. Because then I don't have to go get more lava and more water and then I don't have to make more pistons. hit the limit okay so here we are standing right here and by golly maybe we're about halfway yeah we could be about halfway uh, to the other side uh, I still can't see the city I still can't see the city or the flying ship thingy but I do know it's there. Or just not close enough. It's not close. It's on the top of the little hill right there. You can kind of see where some of the grass is. It's right, or some of the kilt thing, or wherever that is. That's where it is. It's, it's right, right there. And then the flying ship is like right there. So, we still got, I still got quite a bit to go. Oh, uh, before we get uh, to the other side, but, oh my god, uh, this is working pretty well. It's going to take me uh, probably another two to three hours, I think, to complete the bridge. I'm not going to do that now, uh, I but I will be completing it, and I'm not sure if I will do another video or if I will do it on stream. I might stream finishing it. Not entirely sure, but uh, for now, this is what we've gotten done. I don't know what we'll get but uh, yeah, it's this is pretty cool and it's a little scary. That's why I'm crouching right now. <laughs> we're we, we're making progress. It's gonna be a fun bridge to walk on. Uh, but yeah, so that is that's gonna do it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, appreciate you guys watching this on the YouTube if you want to see more videos that I've done on my channel uh, obviously you want to subscribe to my channel and uh, hit that little bell which uh, gives you alerts when I have new content um, but yeah I had a lot of fun doing this and I'm gonna have fun keep when I keep doing this and I hope you guys enjoyed watching this and uh, I'll see you next time everybody in my next video which will be eventually uh so thank you so much and we'll see you later bye bye everybody <laughs>